This applicator though is super handy. I have not had one of these before, but I used my friends a couple weeks ago. Fell in love. Her applicator and I are getting married. We're registered at the Walmart. Hey everybody, you have McGann, and while I don't know a lot about makeup, I do love face masks. So I just found and decided to try out this Spa Scription Superstar Glitter Mask on me and my daughter. It was under $7 at Walmart, and what I liked is that it came with the applicator brush, and hopefully it's decent so that I can use it for more than just this one bottle of, what would you call it, gel mask? I've also bought some of this stuff off of Amazon before, a different brand of course, but it just like ripped my face apart and all the little hairs off my face. So hopefully this is not that harsh, but let's try it out and find out. Oh, guinea pig! And now we have it all unboxed. It was just the applicator and the Spa Scription Superstar Glitter Mask. Let's get this sucker open. And for this, Ooh. and for this, if you have long hair, you want to tie it back. If you have short hair, you want it out of your face too, but that's beside the point. Can you see in there? It's all glittery, goopy. We'll see how it goes. Okay, I'm gonna do my best to not get it in your hair, but I make no promises. That's why I tied it back. I am just gonna use the applicator to put it on the whole way. You could probably smooth it in with your fingers, but it's kind of sticky, so I really don't want to do that by hand, and I don't know how thick to make it. I should have read some directions first, but oh well, I'm a winging it kind of gal. <laughs> You're up for whatever, right? No, as long as I don't get cancer or AIDS, I'm fine. <laughs> So my recommendation, put it on about a half an hour before you take a shower so that way if you can't get some of it off, you can shower and help scrub it off. I used it, I liked it okay. It kinda pinched my face but not as bad as the stuff I bought off Amazon before. But I did let it sit way too long. I probably let it sit for like an hour and forgot about it. So that's on me, look at me please. Can't see if I'm connecting the mask all the way please. Thank you. I'm gonna try and make it all the pieces connected so that it will maybe pull off in one swipe. <laughs> turn, 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 look at me hard. This applicator though is super handy. I have not had one of these before, but I used my friends a couple weeks ago. Fell in love. Her applicator and I are getting married. We're registered at the Walmart. Don't tell your dad. You can be best friends now with the woman who married the Brooklyn Bridge. <laughs> what? Was that a thing? Yeah. I have not heard of said thing. No, I just gotta get under that nose. Okay, I'm gonna try not to touch your lips, but I make no promises again. You already did it when you were putting it on my nose. Oh, whoops. Thanks. <laughs> You're welcome. Don't lick your lips. You are a great test subject, I just want you to know. Man, I love this applicator. It's not a bad set, considering it was, what, six? $6.97 maybe? Hopefully I'll have eyebrows after this. I mostly missed your eyebrows, look at me. Oh, I got a whole little section over here. Boop, boop, ba -da 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 -da. I look scary. Yeah, I'm not gonna put it on super thick because I did not read the directions, so <laughs> it'd probably take hours to dry if I did. You've got a couple thick spots, but as long as that's on for, let's see. Yeah, it looks like jelly, right? Okay, wait, it says to you, see tutorial on globalbeautycare.com. Wait. <laughs> Okay, wait, wait, wait. Let it dry completely. This may take 20 to 30 minutes. Gently peel off in a downward or upward motion from the outer edge. Rinse off all remaining residue with warm water. Refrain from using if you have sensitive skin or are allergic to any ingredients listed in the ingredients panel. Recommended usage is once a week. So I guess we're doing this once a week. Avoid eyes, hairline, and lips. Whoops. It's all right. It's all right. It's all right. It's all right. We'll just make it not so thick by your lips. Burp, burp, burp. Your nose! Your nose wasn't on the list. Just wipe it off where if you feel any on your lip. We'll call that good enough. So how do you feel? I feel tired and very dry. It's been about 25 minutes, so it's in between the 20 to 30 minutes. You can start peeling now. Make sure you keep a collection in your hand though, because I don't want to scrape this stuff up off the floor. How's it feel? Does it hurt or anything? Is it catching your hairs? It's catching all my hairs. Okay, yeah. That's the problem. If it's not a gel mask, it tends to catch every little hair you've got of poor peach fuzz. I know, it did it to me too. I thought maybe it just got too dry, but it's just a tiny bit pinchy. And let's hope that you didn't get any on my eyebrows. 
this. And if I did, you can wash it off in the shower. Balling off your face. Now, as for me, I've showered and gotten all the little bits that I couldn't get off because it dried too much on me. I've gotten it all off now. And even though I've still got some of that lovely acne, which is why I kind of don't do a lot of makeup anyways, it makes me break out. So I'm still learning because of that. But my skin feels so smooth and soft. Like Dorothy Gale, smooth and soft. Nobody ever gets my references. Okay, so the mask, it worked pretty well. My skin's soft, except for my cheeks. My cheeks are pretty much the same. Oh no, your cheeks are a lot less, uh, what would you call it, frictiony, bumpy. It's a lot smoother than it was. Yeah, but it really hurt peeling it off. I just like the sound. <laughs> you like the sound? <laughs> <laughs> but would you do it again? Yeah. Just for the sound of it. Okay, well, thanks everybody for watching, and we'll see you next time! Bye! Ah! Oh, it's so bright. <laughs> Wrong way. First you blast me with coldness in the shower, and now this? <laughs> You're gonna fall. <laughs>